putting in the hours so the rest of us can enjoy one of San Antonio's most popular parks. 70 volunteers spent their morning grabbing trash all over Woodlawn Park. Our Devin Carp was there with them, trash bag in hand, to learn why they care so much and to see how much of a difference they're making. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. There's a lot of different ways to spend your Sunday. And for these volunteers, one of the best ways to do it is by combining worship with picking up trash. I'm glad we're out doing it together. Four eyes is better than two, so as we spot, then we grab with our picker and then we put it in like this. <laughs> Asiz Wow is a volunteer organization within the World Mission Society Church of God, whose members believe that doing the small stuff can add up. We believe uh, that through cleaning up the community, we can make it a safer environment, a more pleasant environment for everyone together. 70 people came together to scout all over Woodlawn Lake Park, looking for trash wherever they can find it. These volunteers want to pick up a lot of trash, filling up as many of these bags as they can, hoping to get 3,000 pounds of it. This group came ready to work, and we're getting at that bulk, we're getting at all the tedious little pieces, everything. Charles Blank is the director of River Aid San Antonio, a nonprofit that works with volunteers and contracts to clean up parks all around the area for a good reason. Is it open? I'm sorry. It's open. Not only is this one of our flagship parks, but this is one of the only natural areas that we have that our Egyptian geese can enjoy and other native animals. He says taking care of what's in your backyard can have a big impact on everything around you. This feeds into Alazon Creek. This affects downstream communities, not just Woodlawn Lake. Uh, we just work in unity all together. If anyone needs help with bigger items, then we just come to help each other. We have radio systems so we can stay in communication so that everything is covered. By the bridge, we have a like hazardous material that needs to be picked up. Ultimately, these organizations want to encourage others to clean when they can and always have spots open for more people to volunteer. That feeling when you all walk away and there's a massive pile of trash staring back at you and, and Woodlong Lakes looking a lot better for not only your crew, but everybody who's here today. Oh, maybe should we go look over there? Oh, yeah. I'm Devin Karp, KSAT 12 News.